Is the famous Michelin star restaurant on top of the Eiffel Tower worth it? It takes a while to get up because you have to go through security and then wait for the elevator to take you up and they're very small. I thought the stone book was the menu, but it's literally just a stone book. That's all it is. Before we ordered, we got this little appetizer and it was pretty unremarkable, but it tasted good. This was our first appetizer and I have no clue what was inside. I don't remember. There were too many things. Taste was pretty good though, but also nothing super crazy. Next up was the burrata and I don't know if this was better than normal burrata, but it was definitely very different and I'm happy that I got to try a different type of burrata and because i'm german i feel like i'm qualified to say this place had really good bread anyways i love scallops and this scallop was so good with the two sauces like i was they tasted great together separate wow and this dish was really crazy it was like beetroot on top of lobster and some kind of foam but it was it might be like one of the best things i've ever tried i love lobster but this was so good i would die to eat it again next was cod and cod kind of always just tastes like nothing except the sauce which was just a bit salty i, I thought it would be better than it actually was i'm out of time check part two for more